just be ready. You know, you're gonna see a lot of you're gonna see a lot of kids that you know nobody's ever heard of, and they're gonna pop out. The Great Creek High School football team entered their third day of practice with lots of ambition. We've got a great group of kids. Uh, we only lost, we lost nine, nine seniors last year, but we had 22 returning. So we, we got a, a, a good group coming back and, and kind of our mantra for the past couple of years has been family. So we, we really embrace that. The Eagles haven't had a winning season since 2016, and they're determined to turn that around this year. UIL Division II, District 2, 3A seems wide open this season. And with those key returners Coach Teal mentioned, anything is possible. Senior running back Isaiah Briones said this is the most talented group he's seen and hopes to make some noise. Ah, uh, sports center top 10. Nah, <laughs> but um, my goals, you know, for, of course, get our first dub. You know, we want to put our name out there. We don't want to be the underdogs no more. We want, we want to change that. And, you know, I feel like if we get that first dub, We'll let everybody know, like, we're nothing to play around with, that we're here for business. Even though all 5A schools played on time last season, unlike the one-month delay from 6A, Teal said it really affected them mentally, especially due to the previous losing seasons under their belt. With the amount of leadership the Eagles possess this year, he feels the team can play better than the 2016 group. Our ultimate goal is we, we feel like we're a playoff team this year. Um, it, it's been five years since we've made the playoffs, and, and we feel like with the the number of kids we got coming back and the experience and the talent that we feel like we're a, a top four team in our district. Grape Creek will host Stanton on August 27th in a non-district game.